26 mile research journey. Watch out. Watch out. Watch out. What? 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 Before I introduce myself, I think I must give thanks to God because it's an opportunity for me to uh, defend my doctoral degree today. It's, as a matter of fact, I'm so excited. God has really helped me to achieve this. I'm Shola Ogolabi. I have my diploma education at the University of Ibadan here, Department of Library and Information Science. That was 1995. I had my first degree in library science too, the master's in library science also. So my doctoral degree, I got it from the Department of School Library and Media Technology, which I obtained today. It is a great thing that God has done, and I'm very sure God Almighty has helped me this far. Uh, Dr. Shola Wolabi, can you summarize your research? The title of my research is Old Factors, Reading, Self-Concept and Anxiety as Determinant of Reading Habit of Public Senior Secondary School Students in Quara State. That is focusing on three independent variables and one dependent variable. Home factors, reading self concept, and anxiety are the three independent variables. And then the dependent variable, which is the reading habit, has some uh, indicators also, which include preference for reading, purpose of reading, and frequency of reading. In a nutshell, I discovered that home factor is key in developing reading habit access to reading materials at home, parental supervision. And there's a challenge today. Most parents don't really have time for their children. And it's a big problem. So that is what I've discovered. If the home is good, then the tendency is there, based on the discovery, for the child to develop positive reading habits. You have parents that read, or parents that focus on their children, the tendency is high for that child or the children to be able to read well. Then also anxiety constitutes a major challenge to reading habits. Children that have been ridiculed, you don't ridicule a child. Children that have been ridiculed, maybe they made mistake reading, or children that do not have financial support from home to buy textbooks and all that, we have low self-concept, and when you have low self-concept, it may create anxiety when it comes to reading. So, in a nutshell, reading a bit can be boosted by parental involvement, access to reading materials at home, good self-concept, and also reduced anxiety. So, what is your advice to parents? Just a brief one, like recommendation in your work. Yes, my recommendation is that Parents need to synergize with teachers to be able to monitor how a child performs in school. When parents just give money, they send their children to school without their own involvement, it may not occur well with the children. So parental involvement is key. And also, teachers from time to time need to allay fear of reading from the art of children. Let's make reading fun. When reading is fun, sincerely, children would develop interest. I don't want to be going to the area of bibliotherapy, cinema therapy. All these are things I've discovered in the course of my research. And I'm sure the race has just begun because I have a lot to deliver. The town and girl relationship is just starting because we must make impact in town in this research. Thank you very much. Um, now that you have a PhD, how do you feel? Wow. And now well, the journey seems very smooth for you. Uh, we know journey is <laughs> so smooth. So how are you feeling today? No journey is smooth, but yeah. I feel so excited. And I feel like a new... You see, you don't say you have ended research. It is just starting. Research is just starting. 
and we'll be looking into different aspects of these discoveries and our parents and their children have developed a lot of and then i must let you know i just published a book the library boy is to promote reading we will say that god will bless you and Amen. make your way uh, straight Amen. as you have uh, your phd thank you thank you very much this is research journey with dr aj Alonso.